I think you're going to find out that, uh, uh, you know, I love what Mark Cuban says all the time about the NFL. He said, be careful what you wish for. You may be running this organization. And, uh, I, you know, we just we have to be really careful. We have to be really careful. We have an unbelievable game right now. We pay the bills. College basketball pays the bills. It always has. And I think we need to be extremely careful. I'm all for getting things right. But I think when you have to go to the monitor over and over and over, you're going to lose viewership, you're going to lose fans, and you're going to lose an excitement and a luster to this game that has always been there. And I think, we, I think we're on a slippery slope. I don't have all the answers, but I do know this. I don't think we can have as, as much stoppage as we've had in the past. And it looks like to me that we're headed to more stoppage. We were just talking about Armand. What do you expect from him this year? Well, you know, the thing with Armand is, you know, and I've, and I've told him this on almost a daily basis. See you, Paul. Uh, I've told him this almost on a daily basis that uh, we need to get out of the point where we look at Armand and say he's got a chance to be a good player. we, we got to get out of that. He's either going to be a good player or he's not, and he's got to make up his mind. He has as much athletic ability and talent as anybody on our basketball team. Absolutely. No ifs, ands, or buts. But he has to make the decision whether he wants to be those guys in life that people say he's always got potential or this kid has reached his potential and is really a heck of a player. If we're not talking about Armand Fletcher at the end of this year and the end of next year, then we've got an issue because I do think he has incredible talent.